a couple of your older projects have gotten new life. I don't know if you know this, but we hear that there's a potential Freaky Friday sequel and Summer School is blowing up online. Like, did you expect that 35 years later? That is, it's all blowing up. Like, people are wanting the sequel and now they're talking about this again. Well, uh, the, the, the first one is because Jamie's talking about it. Yeah. And you know Jamie. Yeah, I love Jamie. Right? I yeah. do too. And yeah. I've known her since she was 15. So, uh, oh, wow. If, she, if she's talking about it, then it'll it's happen. It's probably going to yeah. happen. Because all things happen. Yes. Yeah. Right. Very, but it's, did you ever expect the other one, though? Summer, like for 35 years summer later? School? Yeah, summer, summer school. Sorry, no, no, yeah. No, uh, I, I was just so thrilled that Carl Reiner was interested in me to play this part. And, and then my wife read the script at the same time, said, don't, don't go near this, don't, don't do this. But we have very different opinions of, of material and yeah. things like that, which is healthy. But uh, I just said, he thinks I can do this. Yeah. So I'm gonna do it. Yeah. So I went and did it. I love that. And all those kids. <laughs> But I love that it's like blowing back up. I just think it's cool when it comes back around. It's like music. People like Mike, I hear young yeah, kids talking about music and I'm like, that's like from the 70s. Yeah. Like what? Yeah. yeah. And, and and all those people were young and just starting out at that time, right? Yeah. So so those kids were all over 30 when they were playing high school kids. So of course. Every one of them had an idea after after every scene. Hey Carl, hey Carl, hey Carl, can I do this? And he'd go, <laughs> no. No. Right. Right. Okay. Stick to and, it. Yeah, and, 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 and but so many of the little threads at the end of every scene that he let the camera roll on are in that film. Oh, cool. And, uh, I had a chance to work with him later years, laying down a track for the for the, the movie years later. Yeah. Uh, and a chance to sit with him for four hours and, and do that. And I, I loved that opportunity to finally tell him what he meant to me. Oh, that's so cool. Yep. Yeah, you like to tell people that. I like that about you so far in this interview. You like to like let people know that they like made a change and an impact in your life. That's cool. I was telling you that on the way out. I, well, nobody, not everybody does that. Yeah. Why? I don't know. I don't know. Maybe they feel foolish or whatever. You do that but like, all the time. Yeah. I do. I'm like, well, I'm a very chatty person in general, so I tell everybody no, that's, everything. That's just, there's, a, there's, a, yeah. there's a kindness in that. It's not yeah. just being a chatty person. Yeah. It makes me feel good to tell someone that they've made a big impact on me. Yeah.